Good day, everyone. Caravan Steve, the Let's Go Caravan and Camping Show. We're looking for a big show. We've got 18, uh, 800 square metres, 18 vans, uh, our biggest show ever. But while I'm here, I wanted to do a walkthrough on the Sunset Family Haven 18 foot 6 single axle van. This van, stay tuned for this one. This one, you're gonna love this little van. This has got a little bit of everything in there. It's a little, it's, it's a great compact van for the whole family to enjoy. All right, let's just start, um, we'll start at the back on this one, huh? So this one here, uh, the Sunset Family Haven 18 foot six single axle off-road family van is actually on the great annex stand at site 410, which is right next door to us, because it's got a shade room uh, wall fitted to it, okay? All right, so we're gonna start at the back here, designed and built in Australia for Australian conditions. So. Roadrunner chassis using Australian steel, and we have the Oshtrekker coil off-road suspension as well. External shower, reversing camera. Um, here we've got uh, a little compartment here. So that's there is your toilet cassette. Okay, let's swing around here. It's a double bunk van as well. More storage underneath the bunks as well, so which we can access on the outside going in. Um, 16 inch um, all terrain tyres, and like I said, Oshtrekker coil off road suspension, two fresh water tanks, and a 95 litre grey gray water tank as well. We've got two solar panels on board as well, and we've got two AGM batteries. So we've got battery power, we've got solar power, we've got uh, you know, the water capacity there, so we can be off grid for longer periods of time. And like I said, the whole family can enjoy a bit of off-grid living. We've got large toolbox on the front here. So we've got dual sliders. So on these uh, single axle vans, uh, we've got your gas bottles and they're tucked away inside and protected from the elements as well. Like I said, six inch drawbone chassis. There's a BM Pro uh, stability control. And, but we still got plenty of room here at the front if you want to put bikes. Um, if you want to put a stone shore, Alp or Mitre, you do have uh, that capability right there. Okay, so we've come around, so we're going to do a walkthrough on the inside of the van. Come through this way. Oh, check this out. Look who we've got here. The Hello, man Steve. himself, Mr. Ron Stafford. Hello, viewers. Hello, Stephen. How are you? Oh, look, amazing now that I've seen you, young <laughs> Ron. Uh, we've got this beautiful uh, Sunset Family Haven on, on this. Uh, Great on job your... on the van, mate. It's thank you, thank you. But this is on your van, uh, on your stand? Yes. Um, and tell us all about what we've got here. So, Steve, there's, there's two different types of room products that you can put around your awning. Yep. So everyone knows about an annex, right? They've been around for 30, 40 years longer. They're the canvas walls with windows and doors. And you know, there's a lot of people want them, That's but correct. a lot of people don't want them. True, very true. So generally in the other half who don't want them, they still need to have some form of cover That's or correct. privacy protection, cut the wind back, cut the sun back. Especially for families. Yes. Especially for young families, families as well. Love it. Yeah, yeah. So the kids now with the bunk vans and this beautiful bunk van here, yep. the kids are sleeping inside. We don't really need them outside in the annex anymore. So this become this product here solves that kind of in-between need, yep. uh, which is our shade room. Lovely. So instead of using typical canvas with windows and doors, we now use this really good quality shade mesh material that is very tightly knit, yep. so it still cuts back yeah. a lot of the wind and the rain. True, very true. But it true. also, um, you know, keeps it very simple, keeps the cost down on produ producing it, yep. uh, and it's a great in-between solution to get some cover and privacy without going to the full expense well, of, a, of an annex. And it, is the setup quicker than an annex, in your opinion? That, well, no, it's not, because essentially yep. the only difference between the annex setup and the shade setup is yeah. the specifications of how we make the wall. Okay. So the, the process to still hang the wall is the same. You okay. still put your any flap kit sure. in, you still put your windskirt on, you still feed it all in and out. So yep. it's actually quite much. It's, it, and look, and that's a 10 minute, 15 yeah. minute process. That's correct. On a relaxed pace. But you can decide whether you want your your front here, your sides, or you want the whole shade room, uh, which which gives you that flexibility. Hey, you know, maybe the sun's beaming on this side, or yes. I'll put this side up, or maybe the sun's coming this way, or we want a bit of privacy. Yes. And it just allows you to do much, you've got much more freedom 
uh, with uh, the shade screen uh, walls, don't yeah, you? Yeah, and look, yeah. it, it, you know, um, sometimes people think that an annex room or a shade room has to be completely set up each time you use it. Yep. It's absolutely wrong. Even with our annex products, you can use one wall. Yep. If the wind and the rain's coming from one way, you don't have to put all these ones up, but we're going to block that one out. That's very and good to know, It's no yeah. different with this. Yeah. What, what we find most of the time is that people will always use this long wall. Yep. You know, that's the roll the awning out, feed it into the awning, peg that off and that's the one that, that gets used the most. But then if you get particularly strong wind or rain one way or sun one way on the ends, just throw the one up. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's really flexible. There you go. And, and the flooring comes with it as well? Our flooring's generally an extra. Most people have a lot of flooring already. Yep, sure. Uh, so we don't um, automatically include it, Yep. but it is available. Okay. Yeah. And where can we find you, Ron? We are at the show here on stand yep. 410. Uh, we have the factory in Brendale, but of course, all your wonderful customers can get in touch with all these great products. Um, you know, 10 year warranted, as you keep saying. Yeah, yeah. We say 10 years because mate, we know it's good and your money's safe. And, and that, that is someone that backs their product. 10 year warranty and all Australian made. All Australian made, Brendale, Queensland. We're here, we're doing it, we're doing it properly. We're protecting your your dollars in what you're buying. That's you know, great. You, same with your vans, you're protecting their investment there. Uh, we're the same. We're just the quality option in, in walls um, that's going to look after you when you're out there. That's right. Ronnie, Thanks, thank mate. you, mate. Good to see Appreciate you. Appreciate it. Yep, lovely. And uh, see you soon. Yep, beautiful. This van, the Sunset Family Haven, is on the Great Annex Stand at Site 410. We are right next door to them at Site 400. You've got the checker plate at the, at the, down the side here, and that just gives the van extra protection external speakers we've got two awning lights and there's a picnic table that you can uh, fold down so what we're going to do is we're going to step inside and i'm going to show you the layout on the inside of the sunset family haven 1846 off-road van i'll catch you on the inside okay so we're stepping in the sunset family haven 1846 off-road van um, this is a center door van and I'm going to start in the bedroom and work my way down the back. Uh, but like I always do in all my videos, I just want to point out the room that we have around the bed. Again, folks, it's only an 18 foot 6 van, but we're still managing to walk around the bedrooms, no problem. We've got cutouts on either side. We've got the 214 USB in there as well. We've got storage on either side, three overhead cupboards. Beautiful reading lights as well. We come over here. We'll start with the L-shaped lounge. Uh, again, 18 foot 6 van. Decent size lounge area for the whole family to enjoy. And this table um, drops down to form another bed as well. So essentially giving you the capability to have to be a five berth caravan. And then we just um, hit the button right there and the table just comes up. And this here is like a multifunctional table because it actually moves. And um, a couple of people at the show said to me, Steve, that would be great. Um, we can use it as uh, more bench area here as well, um, which I thought was a fantastic idea. But like I said, a multifunctional table right there. So from the lounge area, we come over to the kitchen area. Again, 18 foot six van. We still got plenty of bench here right here. Even for a single axle van, we got your stove and grill right here. Uh, plenty of cupboard space. Um, again, it's even only an 18 foot six van, but still plenty of room. We've got your beautiful uh, black tap. We have beautiful timber benches, and it just really flows. Uh, uh, the colour scheme inside this beautiful van. Uh, there's your double bunk area. We've got a Sirocco on each bunk as well. And I just want you to come over here. Look at that. That's about 1.9 metres in length. Wow. Look at that. That's a that's decent size bunk areas right here. Like I said, it's a double there. Table converts down and it can be a five berth caravan as well. We've got a set of drawers right here. We've got storage everywhere. Again, it's only 18 foot 6 van, but check out how much cupboard and storage area there is. And we've got the, this Tedford uh, compressor fridge 
right there as well. Uh, that's plenty of uh, space there for the whole fairy to enjoy. But the key to this van is right here in the shower and ensuite. Look at that. I opened the door, separate shower and toilet. Now these vans are very rare to find with double bunks and a separate shower and toilet. I'm just going to sit down here and look at that. So, and this table, uh, this uh, toilet actually swivels right here. So, uh, if we're feeling a bit tight, we can move it to the side here, and that gives us a, a bit more room. Uh, beautiful black hand basin right there. We've got the mirror there as well, cupboard on top, and check this out. Look at this. Check out the shower ball. Look how much room I have here. Wow, 18 foot 6 van. And we've got a decent sized shower mold in here as well. Uh, we've got your exhaust fan at the top there. Look at that, I can really, really um, move in here. Um, I've got plenty of room uh, and I don't feel crammed in here as well. It's, the, the, you're hard pressed to find something like this, very hard pressed. Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed the walkthrough of the Sunset Family Haven 18 foot 6. Couple of key features uh, two solar panels, two batteries, two fresh water tanks, grey water tank, off road suspension, so we can really venture into uh, what I call the unknown um, for the whole family to enjoy. Uh, but double bunk area, uh, separate shower and toilet, plenty of storage. This van, uh, like I said, is the perfect weekender, and you can view it at our dealership at Sunrise Caverns. We are located at 290 Eastern Service Road at Burpa Gary, Queensland. You can give us a phone call 073888-4455 or send us an email sales at sunrisecaravans.com.au. Well, folks, stay safe. Uh, that's a wrap up for me, Caravan Steve. And like I always say, follow your dreams with Sunrise Caravans. Thank you.